Hey planner friends, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a plan with me and it, it's a plan as I go for the week. Um, what I did was I set it up and then every night I added the next day's events um, to the day. So I'm going to do this a week where I'm going to do the sidebar and then I'm going to end up doing Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday all together instead of kind of how I've done before where I'll put down all the full boxes um, and all the checklist and then add my like little things down at the bottom. So I'm using this kit from Lexi Kylie Designs. So you've got all your full boxes, your littles, the date covers, uh, your checklist boxes, all of your washi, your bottom washi, all of the beautiful glitter washi, uh, and the pattern washi, and then your functional sheet with all of your icons, um, another quote box, some uh, little habit trackers, your checklist, um, and then the last sheet has all of your dots at the top, your half boxes, uh, sidebar, daily tracker, and then a bunch of different options for quarter boxes and some headers. So I am going to get started today um, by putting down the really pretty uh, bottom washi. Now this is the first and probably only succu uh, succulent kit I will order. Um, I'm not a, a, like a huge fan of the style, but um, once I got this kit and when I did see it on her website, I just I really liked the way that it, um, how bright it was, I think, um, and the way that the uh, it ha the patterns has like that purple and blue, which if you guys know me, those are my kind of two favorite colors. So I really uh, like this kit and I really like Lexi's stickers and I hadn't bought a kit from her in a little while. So um, when I saw this, I really wanted to use it. I also had put up a poll on my Instagram page about using this kit or a um, a different kit for Mother's Day spread and everybody picked this one. Um, but since I had kind of done that as a like post plan kind of spread, I ended up using this one this week where I would get to see it every day and play with it every day um, and be able to uh, really interact, I think, with it more that week uh, since I was planning um, on a daily basis. So I'm just putting down my sidebar. Um, and since there was two uh, really nice quote boxes, I put one at the top and one at the bottom. Um, I put a list for Happy Mail, uh, which actually I didn't end up filling out too much because um, most of the things that I had bought uh, were ended up coming the week after uh, and weren't actually coming that week. I more ordered it that week, so I probably should have just put it as um, orders because the that PBC sale uh, that pretty much kicked my butt um, was on Friday, and so uh, most of the stuff that I had bought was pretty much this week. So I cut our, I uh, didn't have to cut out, but Lexi Kylie Designs has her logo already print um, cut out. So I put that over on the sidebar too. I like to keep track of whose kit it is, although um, Lexi's are so very kind of distinctive that you don't really have to use the icon uh, so much. But I'm starting with Monday and putting down that really pretty, beautiful full box, a checklist box for myself, um, and then started putting down some littles. Um, I needed to call the um, Lexus dealership because my car was having, it kept saying the maintenance light was on and it's only been driven like 2,000 miles since the last time I took it in. So um, funny story, once I finally, I do end up taking it in this week um, that you're seeing here and the guy kind of laughed at me because I hadn't driven enough to even like warrant being um, taking it in. So he showed me how to uh, reset the maintenance required light on my car. So when it happens again, well, when it happens again, I'll need to actually get some oil change. But when it happens the six months after that, I can do it myself. So uh, so I'm just putting down the, um, uploading my plane with me. Um, I did a plane with me, uh, early that week, uh, pre-plan that was for, um, in my mini happy planner. So if you like those kind of spreads, definitely check out my channel. Cause I have a couple of uh, mini happy planner spreads. Uh, and then I just had my workout for Monday. So you can see um, it kind of changed days. Um, I had added a couple more sticky notes here just to kind of keep track of some more things um, as the day was going on. But I was just um, trying to keep track of different things that were going on. And then what I'm going to end up doing is kind of alternating here the full boxes and the checklist boxes. Um, so then it just kind of looks clean and kind of fun. Nothing looks too, um, I don't know. I guess too straight or too, too the same. Um, 
I am using the glitter headers instead of the um, today headers that she comes that comes with the kit. I really like uh, Lexi's glitter headers. They're really pretty. Um, so I wanted to use those uh, just to kind of make the spread look really pretty. So I'm adding another workout sticker. Um, I'm adding a little get it done with the little three heart checklist just for all the different things that I need to do for my videos, um, which I didn't get any of those things done. Uh, work has been really uh, stressful and busy um, and I've been working a lot. So uh, trying to get um, some of this extra kind of fun stuff that I do in terms of my videos has been kind of pushed to the back burner. So I'm going to try to definitely get more um, things out or get things filmed, um, especially now uh, with this Memorial Day weekend, I'll have a three day weekend. So I can try to uh, get a couple extra things done this weekend. So now I'm just moving on to Wednesday and I'm keeping all of the glitter header colors the same. Um, I did this week um, where they're all the same at the top in the middle and the bottom. Um, I did like the way that I did last week or actually it's the next week, but I, I put the video out before um, where I did color coded days. So I you, would you've used like all the teal on Monday and the pink on Tuesday. And so I really like both versions. Um, they're very pretty. It just depends on kind of what the kit looks like overall and kind of what I'm feeling like at the time. So I really, I also like these littles. I don't always use a ton of littles from kits, um, but I really like the way that Lexi did uh, these littles where she put the little icon and then like a little glitter kind of barrier almost and then like a lighter space um, that you can write on and kind of really see um, what you're writing on. So I thought those were really pretty. I just like that kind of extra added like glitter and separation of the icon that made it really um, nice to use. You can see there I'm using my Erin Condren notebook um, to prop up that right side. Um, it's because that where the planner is um, almost over. There's only a, like kind of a couple pages on the right. And so it's really low in a sense. And so it's really hard to see and get stickers down because that coil is so big. Um, so that's a kind of trick. I just put a little sh smaller like notebook underneath it. And then I'm able to, then it's kind of more even all the way across. So Thursday I was really getting, um, all my PBC stuff, um, stores that I wanted to order from, uh, set up my Etsy cart set up where um, if people had already put stuff out on their Etsy stores I know some people were posting things like Thursday night so then when the sale went live on Friday morning this stuff was there some people already kind of had their stock of things that they were going to um, uh, have in the sale so that's pretty much what I did on Thursday as I really spent um, a couple hours or as time permitted, I guess, um, putting things in my Etsy cart. So then on Friday morning when I got up, I was able to just go ahead and um, place my order. Uh, Thursday was also this huge snowstorm, like blizzard in the middle of Colorado. I mean, it's what, May 18th. Um, we woke up, it was pouring down rain. And then by like two o'clock when I took my car up for that maintenance, it was hailing and just snowing like crazy and I stopped at Target for like 20 minutes just to pick up a couple things like I wanted to get like potato soup and kind of some um, French bread just for dinner because I it kind of felt like that kind of a day and by the time I got out I had to use a scarf that I had in the back of my car to get all the snow off because it was so heavy that my windshield wipers wouldn't even like clear the snow off the car it was crazy so uh, I kind of hibernated on Friday. I uh, ended up working from home and I was able to get up early and do the sale. I didn't have to deal with the weather. Um, and then you see I used a full checklist box and then I added a three heart checklist underneath. And what I'm doing is writing down all of the shops that I bought stickers from. And that was just, I think, on Friday. I actually placed a couple, I think, more orders... Well, maybe that's the whole weekend at this point. I'm doing Friday, Saturday, and Sunday all together. Um, so I think on Saturday, I did place one more order for that Joyful Planner that I had put down there. Um, I also placed some orders for stores, uh, Etsy stores that weren't even part of the sale, but they had some really, really cute die cuts and um, like TN things uh, that I really am trying to get into and, and play with. And so I bought a bunch of um, different uh, die cuts and things from a couple of those other stores. So I think that was um, Sweet Deco Chic and um, 
what does it say there? Sparkly Paper Co. I think they both had some like really pretty deco um, stickers that I used uh, or that I bought. Um, so Saturday and Sunday, I'm just putting the full boxes at the top so I can put the weekend banner on top um, there. Uh, I put the little treat yourself uh, little circle on Friday, uh, put the trash day and the payday. Friday was very busy. You can see I kind of filled it up with stickers all the way from the bottom to the top. So, um, But then on, when, on Saturday, um, I got up and did, I had a massage, um, which was really nice. I was having some back prop back pain from some of my workouts. Um, so it was nice to actually get that in and kind of had like a lazy day. Um, did the massage, but then, um, kind of hung around. I think, uh, at the end of the night, my husband and I went out for dinner. So that was kind of the only really like thing we actually accomplished, I think on Saturday, other than, um, other than me getting that massage. I did play around with my planners a little bit, um, but I kind of just took the day off and, and kind of regrouped. Um, now on Sunday, I woke up and spent, I think I started printing some of like the Annie's Plans printables at like 8.30. And I think I finished in my office like playing, like I was organizing stickers. I was printing out printables. I was like cleaning my office. I was taking pictures for Instagram because I hadn't had enough. I hadn't had a bunch of pictures like previous. So I wanted to make sure I got pictures of like all my weeks and things. And then um, I ended up getting a pedicure at four. So between 8.30 and like 3.30. So I spent the entire time in my office trying to like catch up on everything. I got my filming done. I've got any voiceovers that I needed to get done that day. Um, so I was, I was feeling very productive and, and nice because of my, my office was clean and it was, it felt really good. So, so this is going to be the completed spread. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and, and uh, listening to my weekly recap. Um, if you like this, uh, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.